The school's principal, Stanley Nguyen Nusep, told NBC News that shortage of classrooms as a result of enrollment searches had triggered the creation of an outdoor classroom. He says the school's hall is also being used as a classroom. Tara's education directorate opened the school in 2010 as a new junior secondary to stem classroom shortages at Ketmanswap and it was later upgraded to a secondary school. Its learner enrollment has since grown from 300 to 590. The, the call from the minister and that of the government is that we should not uh, send away learners and we should provide space as much as we can. So now the enrollment number has increased and therefore also the shortage of classroom came to fall. We had to think of something because teaching must continue um, unhindered. Uh, so we then thought of the assistance and also being part of the, the school board, um, of the backing of them and also them being part in the process, we, we came up that we should take this bicycle shed and then change it into at least an open classroom. Wing who have noted there are obviously risk that comes with an outdoor classroom. Instead of now us sitting here and just uh, complaining or complaining, we thought, no, let's make the best of what we have. Um, and, and, and I mean, there are many other schools that are in a very dire need of classrooms. They are in very difficult circumstances that they are going to classes. At least us, we have buildings here. But why should we then be complaining if at least one or two classrooms are outside classrooms? Obviously, well, like I said, with seasons change, changing, uh, when it becomes a rainy season, it becomes a problem. But then we will see how we can cross the bridge when we get there. The school principal says the school management intends to convert another bicycle set into a classroom. He added that the school would accept any financial or in-kind assistance for the construction of classrooms at the school. Luke Mantluta, NBC News, Kietmanzwak.